Hey folks. Hi folks. Mike and Tam here with our occasional weekend channel update. We used to call this Good Saturday Morning, but it, as it turned out, it was <laughs> just as likely. <laughs> yes, it, it, it just as likely to be um, Saturday, Saturday, afternoon. Saturday afternoon or even Friday night when we would shoot these things. <laughs> So it just became a shtick that we both grew weary of. So we've just decided that from now on we would uh, we would just say hi or howdy or yo or something like that, and we wouldn't shtick it to you anymore. There's not a lot of events going on this weekend. We're kind of in a, in an in between pattern. There are some small Christmassy kind of things, but. Uh, there's going to be a lot of Christmassy things over the next few weeks, so we're going to try not to um, hammer you with Christmas all the time. Uh, we have a, a a happy mail opening, yeah, that we plan on shooting this weekend. <clears throat> uh, we were actually uh, we just got through doing a, a tagging video, uploading a tagging video <laughs> last night, but. We got tagged again yeah. for some more questions. These are different. These are, are, are maybe, uh, 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 there's some unusualness in these questions. Yeah. Maybe it'll be kind of like a Rorschach test. Yeah. And uh, you'll see deep inside uh, Tammy's dark little mind uh, <laughs> with these questions. Plus, plus, I have an idea for the way to shoot this. So you know that means. Oh no. <laughs> it means either it's going to fail or fail miserably. And I like those odds. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and do it. Uh, <laughs> but uh, other than that, uh, we have some other videos that were shot we're going to release uh, coming up in the next few weeks. There are yeah. some major Christmassy things going on here, uh, not just antique stores or, um, or Hobby Lobby. There are some uh, Christmas events that we plan on covering over the next few weeks. Uh, we're getting into the Christmas spirit. We've still got our fall decorations up in the house we subtracted all the halloween and what was left <laughs> became the fall decorations the thanksgiving uh, decorations. and usually i already have my stuff christmas stuff up by uh, thanksgiving Do not we? this year hello we might shoot a uh today uh, a dining out video uh tammy and i cannot agree exactly on where to eat she thinks that we ought, well, she thinks that we ought to go to uh the korean barbecue place awesome, uh, awesome, I'm, awesome. I'm sure to many of you that's like really a korean barbecue place some folks may not have been to one it's it's a place where in the in the center of your table there's a cooking surface and they bring you a uh, meat that's been seasoned to varying degrees and very varying mm. cuts that are all good cuts of meat and you cook it yourself and it's delicious i've been there mike hasn't but i have uh and well and and you cook it yourself right yeah and they do too and you pay more for the privilege of, of cooking it but yourself. it's good meat good <laughs> well, quality meat and it's seasoned very well do they um you get sides I, I have too. been to other. I, I've been to Korean barbecue places before, just not this one. Yeah. Um, do they have like the bottomless kimchi there? Do you, or do they only give you I like think, a portion of kimchi, th no, and when it's gone, it's gone. Anything you want more, if you can get. Oh, more of. oh, really? So it's like a oh, it's an all you can eat deal. Yeah. Uh, okay. I, I didn't. I didn't think and about that. And meat too. All you can eat meat. Uh, now I always other, go for the steak. You heard it, folks. Always go for the steak at the Korean barbecue. It's so good. Now, the place that I wanted to, uh, to go to uh, actually is at a local mall. Uh, it's the American Girl Grill. Uh, for uh, those of you who are unfamiliar with the American Girl dolls, there are a line of dolls uh, and doll accessories. Um, a, a lot of the collectors uh, that we know on different uh, YouTube channels that collect dolls they they probably i'm not sure some of them like different kinds of dolls and these are very specific any anyway there's a whole line of dolls and some some of these doll stores have a grill a little restaurant where you can go and sit and eat with a little doll in a high chair as your dining companion that and, sound fun. and tammy does not want to go she no, she has this idea that we are too old to do that and that people might not like it if we showed up there, but uh, it'd make a great vlog, it, it would make a great <laughs> vlog, and that's why but I wanted to go. I'm but, not a uh, pig today, <laughs> yeah. We, we may end up at the Korean barbecue, 
Now really about the only thing else I can think of to cover here is uh, that pretty soon uh, fall will be over and then Christmas will be here right upon us and then after New Year's we will go through uh, the long uh, Nothing the long nothingness between New Year's and mid-April when there are really not a lot of events. At least not a, a lot of events uh, that are free or, or cheap to go to. Yeah. Which is tr why we try, not just because we're cheap, but uh, we want anybody to be able to, uh, to do whatever it is that we're doing. So there won't be a lot of that. So there, there will probably be uh, some more. Uh, we keep bragging on the natural wonders of, uh, of Georgia, but we really haven't shown you much more no, than uh, uh, the ones that just happened to be uh, where we were going anyway. We haven't made these natural wonders uh, themselves a destination as much and we will probably do that through the cold winter months i function better in the cold anyway uh so we'll probably he do still sweats. i'll still sweat but but not as much <laughs> so we'll probably uh do some more of those kind of things uh, outdoorsy kind of videos uh there'll probably be a fair amount of junk and and eating <laughs> and uh and maybe uh what I, I i kind of envision is some of the little smaller towns uh, that have their own little stories in Georgia that we may have skipped over in favor of the tourist towns, the big uh, flashier places. We may visit some of the, the smaller towns and uh, and show them to folks because they have their uh, they have their charms too. Yeah. So uh, that's about all. Tam, have you got any uh, any uh, news or update? Oh, oh. Here's something. Okay. Tammy, Tammy, for the benefit, uh, lean into the camera a little bit. Okay. For the, or, or turn to the side, turn face to face to the side. For the benefit of, of Mandy, of Mandy's Magic Moments, and some of the uh, other folks that notice uh, Tammy when she has new earrings on. These are <laughs> new earrings, are they not, Tammy? Yes, they are. Would you care to tell everyone where you got these new earrings? I have a friend that sells this jewelry called Paparazzi. And everything is five dollars. I even got this ring for five dollars. What's it her? It's uh, a burn on my hand. Has she? Has her business got a? Uh, is her uh, paparazzi business got a name? Do you call it? Anything? Yes, I, we can put it in the link. Uh, but you don't know what we'll it's called right now. It's Tammy's bling on a budget. I bling. Uh, that is it. Bling on a budget. Show those earrings off. They're just hoops. But they look like beaten silver. Yeah. Do they but they're not. There's some kind of metal that doesn't turn, right? Yes, it's nickel-free and lead-free. But uh, we just included that little bit about Tammy's earrings because there are folks that notice from time to time in our videos, uh, Tammy uh, has earrings. Ta earrings are like your one of your favorite that's kinds of, of joints, right? Yeah. You like earrings. Yeah. So, uh, so that's why I did that. She has on your earrings. We thought somebody might notice it, so we went ahead and uh, went ahead and uh, told you about the earrings. So until the next time, another long, too long vlog. This is Mike and Tam saying bye. bye.